selling drugs and all of this because they knew that people would eventually turn to that man. But at this point, it, it, it's a new game. It's a new game. There are no leaders right now. It's only families. It's all about families. If you watch the way Wayne do it, Wayne is one of the smartest artists I know. And, and that's my clip right there. Little Wayne. Wayne is one of, one of my most favorite artists because the man took a hard shift and made it possible by bringing a family together. It's not like a young woman, right? No matter what him or him or her they might be going through, it's all about him and Young Money and Young Money coming up as a family. And Young Money is holding it down as a family. Rick Ross turned around and did the same thing with Maybach Music, made a family, and that's what makes people hot. Yeah, one you know, you know, back back to the um the um NWA movie, a lot of people like because Mr. Brad was talking about this earlier on the show, um, how people was like, oh, you got a beef of security for the NWA movie because it's gonna cause violence and they're responsible for the the, the the fall of the black community. What do you think about that? You know, I said, 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 I but it wasn't, it wasn't in particular us who brought our community down, but, you know, it was the acceptance of that. As a community, we have to admit, we all accepted the concept of that, the bitter but sweet type of lifestyle. You know, and, and man, that's, it's all about, you know, when you look at that movie, we can't say Ice Cube or Dr. Dre or EGE are responsible for bringing a black community down. If anything, we will say that the people who use that image, who portray that image, those who, who set that image, those who plan the image, who gave it to them to take on of themselves, those are the ones who should be blamed for the bringing down the black community. So, but I wouldn't, I wouldn't so much as not those who try so hard to come out of this condition, man, the black community is hard, man. You got mothers with no white cars, no gas cars, no green cars, you know, and they don't know how they're going to make it, but there's no one around to help them. But, you know, Start of the fall of the black community. I disagree with that because before hip hop, 
it was uh, it, it was uh, uh way worse. Like you, even you can go on YouTube and uh Ron Ron Isley, Ron Ron Ron, he pulled he did a song back in the days black and white and he pulled he pulled out a Luger on stage, a gun. So imagine, imagine, imagine like 50 Cent would do something like that right now. You know what I'm saying? That's right. Now think, now think about it. So there's always been a problem, right? Now, how they, how they really did, the industry exposed something that was there. They exposed a conflict. They exposed a damage that was already there. But, you know, we don't look at the black community. We don't look at the people who have who are uneducated, man. And I'm not saying that to say that we are, we have no thinking process or no way of thinking or doing anything, but we have been taught to think a certain way. And that's what I'm saying, man. So it'll take, it'll take real artists like 2 5 It'll take inspiration of people like Donald Martin Luther King to get up and make it happen. It'll take people like the Minister Farrakhan to say, just as you're man, you know, to bring about a, a new thinking, a new pattern of thinking. It's not to try to scare anyone into, you know, changing, but it's to show you that there, 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 there was something wrong with, you know, with the community, man. There was something wrong. There's something wrong when, you know, we have a little snitch or a little on the side of the hood that people are getting murdered, like, like, playing out. There's something wrong with that. Mm. You know, 
Yo, so, so, so you, so you saying, you, so you think society is devolving or evolving? I think you know what. For some who are, who are spiritually gone, they're evolving. For those who are still lost in the material thinking, they are evolving. So the world, I would, I would say that the whole we're walking backwards because everybody is supposed to be walking forward. That's evolving. You know, as long as we're not doing that, then we're evolving and we're. We're going into materialistic thinking. That's, you know, you, it's, you know, I don't want to talk about too much on it, but if you pay attention kind of closely to everyone they call prophet or messenger, anyone who's coming to pass, they always talk about bringing the people from materialistic thinking out of the materialistic thinking back into a spiritual thinking that will help reconnect us. Right? Because if everybody in the world focuses on the differences between each other, then we would always have something to argue about. show can you give the audience your email info etc Shokers and Mr. Brett show. Yo, it was it was great talking to you, brother. Great building with you. Man, I'm, I I'm keep tabs with you.
So I'm going to holler back at you.